In this video, we will discuss the influence of the theory of environmental determinism on the procedural map generator. Environmental determinism is a theoretical framework that argues that the physical environment is the primary catalyst shaping the behaviors, cultures, and social structures of human populations. The central argument of environmental determinism is that man is a product of the Earth's surface. Environmental determinism emphasizes that we can't study humans separately from their environments. Our relationships with the Earth are far more complex than those of animals or plants. Fields like anthropology, sociology, and history often miss the full picture because they don't thoroughly analyze the geographic factors at play. While humans boast about comfort conquering nature, we often overlook how persistently nature influences us. The geographic factor is like a silent partner in our history, constantly shaping and guiding human development. Environmental determinism argues that our cultures, our history, our everything is a tug of war between two forces, what people are made of and where they find themselves. The forces of culture and ambition collide with the external, unchanging presence of the land beneath their feet. The land isn't just a stage on which human events unfold, it's a character in the drama, but it's one that does not shift its role. It has been a constant player in the story of mankind, stubborn and unyielding, shaping lives and empires, wars and migrations, as it has for millennia. It is a force that remains while others change. What benefit does environmental determinism bring to the procedural map generator as a theoretical framework? Well, it brings enhanced legibility and coherence. There's a clear cause and effect relationship. By grounding cultural and societal traits and geographical features, users could easily understand why certain cultures develop specific characteristics based on their environment. These direct connections between geography and culture make the generated world more intuitive and easier to navigate mentally. Enhanced legibility is essential for procedurally generated worlds because these environments often function as single-use experiences where users need to quickly immerse themselves without the burden of deciphering complex underlying systems. Just as a single-use item must be intuitive and immediately functional, a procedurally generated map or world must present clear and coherent visuals, landmarks, and cultural cues that allow users to effortlessly understand and navigate the space from the moment they engage with it. This immediate clarity ensures that users can jump straight into enjoying the experience without frustration or confusion or having to dig through all the data which will maximize their enjoyment and satisfaction. By making the world easily graspable, enhanced legibility transforms each unique generation into a more accessible experience. Even though I acknowledge that environmental determinism can lead to increased legibility for procedural generation of worlds, you also have to recognize that it's a theoretical framework that tends to simplify complex interplays of factors that shape cultures and civilizations by attributing disproportionate emphasis to environmental conditions like climate, geography, and natural resources. By doing this, it neglects the significant roles of social, political, economic, and technological influences that also drive societal development and change. It's a reductionist approach that can lead to a deterministic interpretation of history, implying that human agency and innovation are secondary or even irrelevant compared to environmental constraints. Additionally, and here's where it's particularly problematic, it often overlooks diversity and adaptability of human responses to similar environmental challenges, and it thereby fails to account for the varied outcomes observed across different societies facing the same ecological conditions. And this simplification can perpetuate stereotypes and justifications for inequalities, suggesting that certain cultures or groups are inherently superior or inferior based solely on their environmental context. And we see this a lot in the early adherents of environmental determinism. So while we recognize that some parts of the theory may be beneficial to our generative approach for the procedural map generator, we also recognize that we need to be careful in what we adapt. Thanks again for watching as we start to develop the theoretical framework for how geography will influence history and culture in the procedural map generator. Be sure to check out the procedural map generator at ck2rpg.github.io slash generator. Hit like and subscribe below and reach out to me on Discord if you have any questions.